In this video, I'm gonna show you step-by-step -step how to transfer your domain to Hostinger. So the first thing we wanna do is go to domains. And then here, let's click on transfer an existing domain. Now, there are three requirements to be able to transfer our domain to Hostinger. The first one is that at least 60 days need to have passed since the initial domain registration or the last transfer. So if you have just bought that domain or you have transferred it to the other provider, then you need to wait at least 60 days until you can transfer it to a new provider. Then we also need to make sure the domain is unlocked, which I'm gonna show you how to do. And then we also need the authorization code, which I'm gonna show you how to get in this video. So first, let's make sure our domain is unlocked. To do this, we have to go to our provider where our domain currently is located. In my case, this is Bluehost. So here I will log into my Bluehost account, then go to domains, and then look for the domain that I want to transfer. In my case, it's this one right here, Medix Tutorials. So I just click on this domain. And then here we can see the domain is still locked. So let's scroll down and click on transfer or move domain. And then here next to domain locked, let's switch this to off. Next, we wanna request our authorization code. So let's click on request auth code. For the reason, I'm just gonna select, I found a better price and click on continue. Then click on continue with transfer and send auth code. And now the request has been submitted. And as we can see here, it can take up to three days to get the authorization code to our email inbox. So now it's three days later, it actually did take Bluehost three days to send me the authorization code to move my domain. So if you're using a different provider, maybe it's a bit quicker for you, but worst case, you also have to wait a few days until you finally get your authorization code. So you should get an email that kind of looks like this, where you can see your domain and your authorization code. So let's go ahead and copy our authorization code. Then let's go and log back in to our hosting or dashboard. Then here, let's go to domains and click on transfer an existing domain. And then down here, let's enter the domain we want to transfer and click on transfer. And now we can see that our domain is ready for transfer. Now to be able to transfer our domain to Hostinger, we need to buy another year for using this domain on Hostinger, but the months that you already have on the other provider will be added onto this year. So here on Bluehost, you can see that the renewal date for this domain is the 16th of November, 2024. And now when I purchase this here on Hostinger, it will be the 16th of November, 2025. So let's click on purchase, choose payment method. I'm gonna go with credit card, then just type in your information here and click on pay now. And then here we have to paste our authorization code. So let's do that. And then down here, we can choose what we wanna do with the name servers for this domain. Now, if you're still hosting your website that is under this domain on another hosting provider, then you probably wanna keep your existing name servers until you have migrated your website to Hostinger. Now, if your website is already on Hostinger or you wanna just create a new website using this domain on Hostinger, then you can choose this option here, use the Hostinger name servers and DNS records. In my case, I wanna change the name servers to Hostinger servers. So I'm gonna choose this option and click on transfer domain. And that's it. The domain transfer can take up to five to seven business days to complete. And once it's completed, the domain will appear in your domain list.